Lab is known as the flow cytometry resource on, on campus where you go if you want things to work. So I really am happy that our staff is really well trained and we can help people um, with some of the hurdles of flow cytometry and really work through uh, problems with them and design good assays that give them the data that they need. We're a shared resource, so we have a lot of different customers. We offer cell sorting services and analysis services. Customers can operate the equipment themselves if they're trained, um, but we also offer a core run uh, service for them, and we have maybe 30 40 percent of our um, usage is people who, who just really don't feel comfortable running for themselves. So we um, analyze for them, run the samples through, sometimes just give them the data for them to further analyze, or we'll even analyze it and send it off to them. There are a lot of people who have their own small flow cytometers now. Um, you know, they're affordable small systems, and we made the decision several years ago that we would focus on the high-end equipment because the high-end equipment can do very complicated assays, but it does the easy stuff too. Well, since we run for so many different customers, we want equipment that can handle multiple types of tubes. It was really important for us recently to have a plate sampler. We had a, a system that had um, somewhat of a plate sampler, but it was a little complicated to use, and we didn't want anything that was where we had to make some type of a complicated switch between those two systems. We were asked to be part of a team to design a new uh, analyzer. It was a team of uh, multiple people um, in flow cytometry from around the world and basically designed our dream machine. So that was really fun to be listened to and then to actually see it put together. I am really pleased with the ZE5 in that the tube sampler and the plane sampler are one and the same and there's no switching in between, so there's no time lost between customers. The fact that it's, it's so compatible to whatever walks in the door, really happy with that. Our lab needed an analyzer with more than 10 colors. The science was going that direction and we didn't have one, but we wanted an instrument that had no collinear lasers and was easy to use for our customers. People are usually standing in line to use the instruments, so we didn't have time to be switching between tube station and plate station, and the ZE5 definitely could handle that. So we have several customers that are doing rare event analysis, particularly stem cell type applications, and I was just actually using the ZE5 on uh, Monday, doing some side population analysis, which is a rather rare stem cell event. And I have to say that I think the side population on the ZE5 is really a work of art. Well, the ZE5 has definitely helped us move beyond 10 colors. And we, as soon as we really opened it up to our customers, we had people walking in the door with 14, 15 colors. I think the ZE5 is a gem.